Questions used to run through my mind, such as why do women have to wear the hijab and men don't? Are men superior than women? Why does it seem like Muslims are terrorists? Who was the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him? When I was 19 years old, I started to think about the purpose of my life and the hereafter. I did not know what it was, but something made me look into the religion. And at this point in my life, I was not a religious person. I was brought up to be a Buddhist, but I was never practicing. Buddhism just never touched my heart. At 15 years old, I used to read books on Buddhism through my own free will, but the more I kept on seeking knowledge about the religion, the more I realized it was not for me. It just never made sense to me. So when I reached the age of 19, and as I was seeking a religion to follow, no other religion spoke to me except Islam. I don't know why, but it just did, even though my family did not like the Muslims. Questions used to run through my mind, such as why do women have to wear the hijab and men don't? Are men superior than women? Why does it seem like Muslims are terrorists? Who was the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him? Etc. Etc. There were people in my life who kindly answered every question that I had. I used to research the religion online and read countless books to ensure that the religion was from me. Without even realizing it, the more knowledge I gained about Islam, the more I changed as a person, including my appearance. I started to dress more modestly and I looked at life in a different light. After two years of reading, watching YouTube videos and asking all the questions that I had, I decided to do something that shocked everyone, especially my friends and family. I wanted to become a Muslim and submit myself to Allah and Allah alone. This happened during the London riots. Those who live in London or the UK would know about this, which occurred during Ramadan. It was coming to the first week of Ramadan and I wanted to fast. I don't know what made me decide this, but I wanted to know what it felt like to fast on this sacred month in which all the Muslims around the world would all wake up to eat, fast and have iftar together. I woke up the next day and immediately I said to myself, if I'm going to fast, why shouldn't I do it properly and become a Muslim? That was my instant thought. There and then I realized it was time for me to be officially a Muslim. I traveled to my workplace where my manager who was a Muslim. She put on a hijab for me. After she finished, she stared at me for a few seconds, smiled and said, your face is full of noor. I couldn't help but smile. I then drove to East London Masjid and took my shahada. I can't explain just how I felt then. My body was just full of peace and tranquility. Islam touched my heart in a way that no other religion could do and I have never looked back again.